We're actually in the heart of Norfolk, 211 West 24th Street at O'Connor Brewing Company. We have a chance to meet with Kevin O'Connor himself. He's got to get a chance to uh, pick his brain a little bit, ask a few questions, and see what he has to offer inside. Let's take a look. I'm Kevin O'Connor, founder of O'Connor Brewing Company right here in Norfolk, Virginia. I'm happy you guys are here to hang out with us today. Fantastic. See, I was telling Kevin earlier that uh, Namarama basically started with a few friends of mine and I, actually in my mother's basement. Uh, we'd get together on Fridays, you know, cook some burgers and actually drink local beer. So I figured, why not do this on a normal, a weekly basis? So um, it felt only right to come back to Norfolk, which I call home. I truly love this area and actually meet with Kevin, um, you know, most popular number one brewery, in my opinion, in the area. O'Connor, your last name. Yep. Did you know from the start you were going to be doing beer? Like, why beer? Uh, I'll be honest with you. It all started uh, my freshman year in college. Um, my dad always joked that I had a uh, high taste in alcohol consumption. <laughs> and uh, it was actually back in 1995, I, I fell in love with craft beer. And um, I was buying uh, good beers from a store in Blacksburg. And it was the manager there ended up um, convincing me to buy a homebrew kit. Nice. And that's how it all started. Really? You know, cooking beer on a hot plate and almost got thrown out of college for it. <laughs> you know? Well, I mean, we're talking about it enough. My mouth is actually pretty dry. I'm salivating yeah. over this, the sound of what you're talking about. So, bring some beer with me here? Of course. Awesome. Let's get some beers, man. Back. Kevin O'Connor here. Figured we uh, we'd taste a few of the offerings you have here. Um, so which way should I go here, Kevin? Uh, well, again, like we were talking about earlier, the way I would do it is start light to dark. At the end of the day, you know, you start putting IPAs before certain things, and those bitterness levels can kind of ruin your palate right. to really taste what's going on. So on the list we have right now, we have our Green Can Gold Ale, and then the next one up is our Red Nun Red Ale, and then this is our Norfolk Canyon Pale Ale. This is actually our Guapo Agave IPA. I'm try that one and then sure. we have our Great Dismal Black IPA. Mm -hmm. That's our Dry Irish Stout. We named it Otis O'Connor Dry Irish <laughs> Stout. This is our Lil Sippa Session Lil, IPA. Lil Sippa yeah. Session IPA. It's only about four and a half percent, so it's actually one of those okay. ones you can actually drink like many a, of. Like a Sessions yeah. kind of thing? Okay. Right, Kevin, uh, I want to say thank you again. Yeah, appreciate man. it. No this problem. was an awesome experience. Thank you. I appreciate um, you coming. Yeah, absolutely. My, my first craft beers was an O'Connor beer, um, and the fact that I'm actually talking to Kevin O'Connor right now is actually kind of wild. Uh, he says he's not that cool, but I'm not that cool. He's a pretty cool dude to me. So yeah, again, thank you so much, hey, Kevin. Man. I no problem, it. man. I appreciate it.